Hi, I'm Rob Chapman. And uh, take two. Hi, I'm Rob Chapman. And I'm Luke. And welcome to Bomb Olympus here in Mosta Malta. Indeed. Uh, home of Tone. Indeed. Great gear. Ibanez, Yamaha, Katana, Boss, Orange, Marshall. All the good things. Yes. But in, in particular, this beautiful Luke Grek that you see here before you. <laughs> and also, this Pacifica. Indigo blue. Okay, let me actually confirm that. It, although it looks like green, it is actually indigo blue, yes. Wow. It's like, but it is kind of a bluey, you know what it's like? Uh -huh. It's like if you swim to the bottom of the blue lagoon yes. and you half close your eyes. Exactly, this then, is the kind of colour that you see. This is the kind of colour that and you see. And the flame is actually simulating you squinting. You know? Yes, it's squint Lovely. simulation. Yep. Squint. How do we know that we're not already in a simulation? <sighs> that we'll never know, actually. Plausible theory, though. And do you know what I was thinking? If the Matrix was real and mm -hmm. we were stuck in 1999, mm -hmm. I'm down for that because oh, definitely. the last definitely. couple of years have not we're been easy. Not really, I'm like, yeah, yeah. 1999? I mean, that was, it wasn't a great year, but it wasn't like, a, I mean, actually, some bits were really bad. <laughs> but then true. some okay. bits were kind of like fine. Yes, you looking know? back, when, relatively speaking, compared to the last two years, again, was as you mentioned. Severe lack of okay. plague. Lack of plague. Lack of plague, yes. You know? We could do without one, yes. The algorithm was a bit nicer. Exactly. The things were... And as the term coined, we could party like 1999. Yeah, man. But okay. Yeah. Anyway. Yes. Uh... <laughs> Speaking of the 90s, this lovely model was born in 1990. Oh. The, the first Pacifica was actually um, released to the public in 1990, the year I was born. Yes, I'm old. I'm 30. Dude, that is not old. I am, I am 32. <laughs> I'm level 46, actually. Okay, level I'm kind of 46. proud of being level 46. Yes, definitely. Nice something to have. Feels great. Yes. Uh, so, we know that it's got some Seymour Duncans because... Yes. Don't, don't drop your phone. I'm really nervous that you're gonna, your phone is going to fall on the floor. Actually, the Seymour Duncans are SSL1's classic, classic um, single coil pickups and it's a TB14 trambucker. A custom, Duncan custom TB14. Nice. Wait, yes. Duncan custom? Yes, a Seymour Duncan, it's called the Duncan Custom, that's the name of the model. I get it. Not sure because it's actually a custom made, uh, right. like, but it's called the Duncan Custom. TB14. TB standing for Trembucker. Those who uh, aren't very familiar with how Seymour Duncan coins their models. Um, HB normal humbucker, TB Trembucker. Yeah. What's the difference? Basically the string spacing for guitars which have a tremolo. Like this lovely Wilkinson VS1000, I'm not mistaken. Lovely tremolo you know what, on mate? this guitar. Trevor Wilkinson knows how to make a great tremolo. Indeed He's he a does. highly experienced yep. engineering legend, Trevor yes, Wilkinson. Indeed. Um, indeed. I love his hardware. We use it on all sorts of stuff that I manufacture. Indeed. And I've said in a previous video, I've had a relationship with Yamaha guitars since I was a tiny, tiny 16-year-old boy. Yes. Probably about that tall. I don't know how tall I was. In fact, when I first moved to Malta ah, and yes. got my flat, the first guitar I bought yes. from this shop was the Yamaha. I was with you on the day. You were, yeah. Yep. I really remember fondly that day. Indeed, you uh, do. I was like, I need a cheap guitar, something that will help me out. It's a Yamaha, it's going to be good. Definitely. Um, should we take a listen? We're plugged into a JVM 210H. We're not going to be extreme crazy game. No. Maybe I will. <laughs> tiny note you hit up there was the best note you've ever played. <laughs> a rake yeah. with the finger, it's a finger rake. And that was all on the, the neck single coil? Yes, yes. What's it like on an in-betweeny? In-betweeny, middle or in-betweeny. Wherever you want it. Okay, so let's move on to the next position. Position two or four, depends how you look at it. So this is a bit more... Neck and in the between. Thank you. 
next one? Yeah, do it, do it. Then, move on straight to the humbucker. How the open oh, chords man. literally still are defined. You can just listen to each string, but has a lot of punch. Why does it there. sound authentic? How do you describe the sound of authenticity? And yet, it has an authentic sound. Yes. That's interesting. Definitely. And Yamaha have been around for years, because I remember buying my first ever Yamaha guitar, and I went, oh, I thought they just made motorbikes. And the, the little guitar shop laughed at me. <laughs> And, um, Common misconception, though, but oh, yeah. very nice to realise that they make actually impeccably good instruments as well. Talking of motorbikes, so this has nothing to do with this guitar. Uh -huh. Did you know that Malta is giving out £2,000 uh, Grant? grants uh. if you buy an electric bike? Yes. I had no I idea. I actually got a €400 Euro grant on mine. But they, they give up two grand, mate. I think it depends on which kind of motorbike. Because there's a... I don't know. Like what, a, sorry, this has nothing like to do with this video, but basically... That there's this really cool electric motorbike and you get two it's three grand you get two grand off from the government exactly i'm like that's pretty cool to promote electric vehicles um having more on the streets yeah I mean, but i can't i can't ever buy one i'll just kill myself can't do it <laughs> can't do it i'll wrap myself around a tree you wrap yourself if i can find one in my tree will come in the middle you know, yeah <laughs> it's got too many the trees fall <laughs> and you know you sue the tree and but that's cool man i that's think that's it cool is, yes yeah. very nice initiative can i play it of course you can thanks luke Looks really nice. Oof. It is a really quality feeling instrument, isn't it? Definitely. 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 How would you describe this in Italian? <laughs> Certamente. Certamente. Mm. Tanto espresso. Tanto espresso. Yeah. I don't know anything in Italian, I'm sorry. Everyone in Malta speaks Maltese, English and Italian. Mm -hmm. And I speak English and about 3% Maltese now. Yes, it does. A bit more than 2%. Tu calme bel Maltese, petite. Really easy to play, isn't it? Definitely. Just feels like a quality guitar. If you close your eyes, I mean, it kind of feels like a high-end F type <laughs> thing. Yep. But then the pickups take you, you have to a coil a... tap as well, by the way. That's one. Oh yeah. There you go. See, click. Oh damn. It splits the humbucker. <laughs> guitar yep and uh yeah it's nice <laughs> yeah it's nice rob chapman 2020 what is it one two 21 god i wish it would be 22 soon soon really good yeah yep um i don't know what else there is to say obviously it's a beautiful maple neck yep. um it's got frets it's got dots so you can see where you are yes uh rosewood 
Yep. Um, what was the top wood? It's uh, an older body with... Oh, tree wood. That's what it is. Yes, tree wood. Edge... Uh... Edge wood from a tree. Nah. <laughs> it is... Oh, a Graftec tusk nut as well. Mm. Interesting. Grove oh, I should have tree. smelt that. You're absolutely right. And also Graftec uh, string trees, yes. I think. Actually, it's a VS50 vibrato bridge, not a VS1000. I oh, stand Luke. corrected. How did you get that wrong? Cool. The whole world is going, actually, Luke, it's a VS... I can't believe that you got this Butcher me on the comments. Exclamation mark, exclamation mark, unsubbed. <laughs> unsubbed. You asked uh, me for the top. It's a flamed maple veneer top oh, it is with an veneer. older body. Okay. Maple neck and... Uh, older than me, probably. Older uh, than you. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Grover Tuners, 18-1 ratio. Yes. Mm. Lovely and, um, matching headstock. Yeah, you know what? Also, giant shout out to my, my best mate, Tony Kurumi, yes. the uh, tech and many other things here yeah, at the Olympus. wonderful Olympus. Yes. Yeah. He's a great dude who went, no problem, bro. I string this with 10 to 52 strings for you. Tony Ilking. That's Ilking. Sorry, Tony. It's not how you sound, but everyone will think it is now. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, there you go. It's the Pacifica from Yamaha. Come yes. to Olympus in Malta, in Mosta. Get yourself a drink at Palma. Come here. Why not? Yeah, it's too. fun. We might even be here hanging out, buying things. Like that Studio Marshall that we really like. Or the yes. red the red speakers that are really cool if you're a From my Helix. session Helix playing mm. random person like like mini John Lennon. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, love you guys. Take it easy. Subscribe, like, comment, nice things. We'll pick see you later. Yeah. Bye. Throw your pick, Luke. I don't have a pick. you got to be prepared for the end so that you can just launch. You <laughs> Shall I throw it now? Try, try and get right on that camera lens. <laughs>